Experience and enjoy our region each week with the Appalachian Adventurer. At Rocky Fork, we have two types of fireflies that are very important to us and are crowd pleasers. All together, we have close to 20 species of fireflies all together. But the ones that are really the showstoppers are our blue ghosts and our synchronous fireflies. Uh, blue ghosts, they're found throughout southern Appalachia and Rocky Fork. We have hundreds of them in a couple spots, and they're real eerie and cool, and they'll leave their lantern on for up to a minute, and you'll see them like floating through the woods, this dim, blue, ghostly light, hence the name. And the other ones are the synchronous, and a lot more people have heard of synchronous fireflies. Uh, they like to, they're one of the only species that'll kind of synchronize their light. So they'll flash off and on up to seven times. And the name synchronous comes from they all go dark at the same time. They don't all flash at the same time. It will look like it because of the, they're so quick. You'll, human brain will see patterns in it. But the name synchronous comes from the synchronized darkness. And it's all a big mating ritual. It's all trying to find a girlfriend or a boyfriend and make next year's Firefly show successful. So year one, we were like, let's let's have an event to celebrate these guys and bring some folks out to see them. We released like 150 tickets and they were all sold in seven minutes. And, you know, use the Smokies as a model and just to increase fairness and give everybody an opportunity. We have a lottery and it's opened up today, Friday, and it'll run through next Thursday. And so just go on there, you can, uh, put in one submission per night, so six nights, six submissions for tickets, and um, last year we had about 14,000 lottery applicants, and we select 10 per night. Their light is very dim, and so you need a real long exposure photograph for them that like lets in tons of light. Cell phones can't capture them, video equipment usually can't capture them, uh, it's just something you got to be there to experience. And even a photograph can't really, like even a good photo doesn't really show you what the feeling is. Um, and if you are lucky enough to get selected during the night and you want to come out and take photos, we ask that all light be covered up. We have a big list of firefly etiquette stuff that we ask people to think, like no perfumes, no smoking, no flashlights, no flashes on cameras, stuff like that. Friends of Rocky Fork help us out a ton. They provide volunteers for the events, and we even have a special night for the Friends of Rocky Fork. So if you're not selected, make sure to join the Friends of Rocky Fork. You can get a membership for as low as $25 a year, and come out and help us out with these Firefly tours. And they even have a special Firefly night for Friends members. 